as was pointed out in the courtroom for the record, um, it's Warrior Chief John Levi that is keeping the peace uh, and not the RCMP. And why would the judge um, agree with the Crown, uh, i.e. our government, uh, to keep John Levi in jail over the weekend? I just it doesn't make any sense. In the legal people chosen for John uh, Levi, T.J. Burke, who I understand has been chosen to represent him, was a minister in the Sean Graham Liberal government that actually negotiated the agreements for the shale gas developments. This is absolutely a travesty. I have mixed emotions. I'm kind of positive in a way that um, this matter will be dealt with because John has been uh, under attack from the RCMP since we started this no shale gas about four weeks ago. He has been getting received a lot of um, um, phone calls and texts from RCMP uh, demanding and even threatening him, you know, that they want to see him, that they were going to see him today. If not today, then they're going to catch him one day. And this was like a couple weeks ago. And uh, the charges that he's charged with are, are like really, really crazy. They I've been highly visible at uh, a variety of other events where there was ample opportunity to arrest me if there were charges against me far before yesterday. And not only that, but on the 30th of June, I was asked to come in. Uh, yeah, some police came to my house in Halifax saying that uh, they want to talk to me in Moncton. So I promptly called the police in, uh, in Moncton, scheduled an interview did the did the interview related to a fire that I was the first responder at and when that interview ended they offered me cash to inform for them at that point there was again no mention of any charges against me and that to me that would have been a, a good time to if, if, if there weren't opportunities before that which there were to arrest me as a working journalist here the rights to um, to your equipment your recording gathering equipment uh, your cell phone, for example, your camera, are protected and can only be used if they believe there's something related to the alleged incident that they're arresting you for on there. I'd be fascinated, I, I truly hope in good faith that nothing was examined. I mentioned my rights as a working journalist to the police as they took my things away. I mentioned that you have no right to look at my cell phone or camera. They said, we're sealing them in this bag, we're putting them under lock and key and there's nine cameras on us, we will not be looking at them. I can only go on their word on that because for the span of four hours I was in a cell, so I don't know what happened.